when you see all these central bank digital currencies uh, that they're talking about, regardless of which country they're being launched in, uh, I think we just saw like uh, Brazil, maybe in the last couple of days, uh, put an Ethereum smart contract up for like, you know, some kind of proof of their CBDC. Uh, and it's got like burn and move addresses and like freeze uh, sort of functions in the smart contract. Uh, and the idea is they can just take your money uh, and say, poof, it's gone. Uh, they can say, we want to credit this account with more money. Poof, it's there. <laughs> like, that's not different uh, than how currencies work traditionally now, uh, <laughs> except it's easier to reach uh, for them. They don't have to go into your mattress. They don't have to count your bills because they can see every bill everywhere all the time. Uh, they can track all of the tokens. Uh, and that's extraordinarily dangerous. And this is why you know I'm constantly preaching against uh, central bank digital currencies. <laughs>